Yep. And it seems no like we have problem. Some other people coming. Wait, we're, mm -hmm. here, we're here, we're here, we're here, we're here. I'm so sorry, we're late. We're here, we're here. Are, are you okay? Are you huh? okay? Uh, Where? Oh. We're here, we're oh. here. Oh. Uh, oh. Hello. Is it, wasn't this supposed to be like a proper meeting or something? Why this are they is in a their proper PJs? meeting. What? What is? What is? Okay. Take, uh, take a seat. At, uh, uh, are, can, we, okay. can we sit at the table? <laughs> just yeah, go sit and table. just whatever. Just, just sit. Thank you. Okay. okay. So it's sorry fine. we're late. So sorry. Uh, had an early, uh, had a morning rush, is that the, what it's called? Oh, we stayed up a little late, but it's fine, so you guys didn't start without us, did you? We just Not started. Exactly. No. So, yeah. Perfect. <sighs> Anyways, I brought you all here because I wanted to talk about the curiosities in this prophecy. Seems Wait. Like we've learned a bit more information. What's the, the curiosities? The... Did, I, did I miss something? The Another prophecy, the, all the uh, things connected, the yeah. artifacts people have been looking for. Mm -hmm. That's what we're calling them, the curiosities. That I thought it's that was less vague word. than artifacts. The curi yeah. uh, I suppose you're right. Okay, can continue. Regardless, it seems like we might want to start pushing towards gathering them. There's been a lot of issues going on in the background, and yeah, I, believe... I think we should address some of those issues going on. Uh, I concur. Huh. Yeah. What issues are I mean, happening. We sure. should. Depends on which ones we want to bring up. I don't know if we need to bring them up specifically, but I think everyone on this table should be on the same side. He says we're not. Oh, easy to send them freaking done. But you know, I don't think everyone here should be fighting each other without, you know, talking about it first. Um, oh, guys. Huh. Um, two things. What did I miss? And who's that? KL. Hello. Come sit down. Oh, you. New camper is the, again? Is this the guy yeah. you were mentioning before? Lila with me? That's right. Uh, and who might you be? My name is Gael. Okay. Gael? Mm -hmm. Can we call you Kale? No. Mm. My name nope. is Gael. Gael. Gael? Alright. Gael. Gael. Kale. 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 He knows a thing or two okay, about prophecy. It. And mm -hmm. oh, oh, you know stuff. Yeah, he's here to help the fates move as they should. Good. Oh, and then speak if you feel. There's only so much that I can say. There are things oh. none of you should know. Oh, any if wisdom? If I tell you, then the prophecy will not continue as it should. Fate will oh. not continue as it should. I will not be the reason for that. All right. Well, we're gonna do a lot of theorizing today, so. If you could give us a little confirmation when we're right about something, like a little wink or a knock on the desk, might be rather helpful. Sorry, son of Hades. I cannot do that. Ooh, Hades? Hades. It's, it's a thing. So you're not here to help us? No. What? Oh, so you're trying to stop us? No. Oh, then what? Are you what? just observing? Like, what's the, what's the point of even being here? I am keeping an eye. There are things wrong. Just, just okay. one eye? Why not both? Well, you don't say I'm keeping eyes. Uh, I'm keeping an eye. Yes. Oh. Oh. Look, if something goes terribly out of place, I'd rather have him here with us than elsewhere. So. I guess more allies are good mm -hmm. than, than enemies, so... Yeah, yeah. I was gonna yeah. say. He's sure. not an enemy. more people no. we can have working together on this, the better. Even if... People aren't always contributing the most oh, to uh, mm -hmm. helping us all. Well, as long as he's not against us, uh, no harm, then there's no harm. Not at yeah. the moment. Not at the moment. That's well, not exactly reassuring. Thanks for telling us now. Well, no one Kyle, has stepped Kyle. out of line. Se uh, Mitch, Fantastic. Okay, he's here. He's, he's not going to, you know go rampant in Atlantis, is he? Well, we have a treaty, by the way. Oh. No one's allowed to fight in here. Well, I don't plan on breaking that, as I said. I'm not oh. going to fight him. Oh, okay. I didn't think so. <laughs> Good. Wonderful. Good. Right. Uh, regardless so, of... Let's get back on topic here. Yeah. Impu, how about you tell us a little bit that you did find out? Hmm. 
<sighs> All right. Okay, sure. Yeah, I'll come to the front here just so that everybody can see. All right. Well, as you guys probably already know, I was doing a lot of research over here for potential artifacts or curiosities as to what this whole prophecy thing that your highness has decided to give us all to make sure that the peace is good and that evil will be vanquished blah 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 you know all stuff whatever um by going through a bunch of libraries there were a few potential artifacts we might be you know going getting our hands on one of them is the uh the hammer that we were talking about before called ragnarok I believe wait um Mjolnir. But another... <laughs> I, I caught How myself important. I caught myself, okay? How would you do it again? <laughs> wow. It's Mjolnir. Oh my goodness. Uh, love of mess up a hammer for the end of worlds. <laughs> please, stop. Like, honestly, okay. It's okay, just so a slip it's up. It's it's, it's, it's a thing. It's happened. It's kind of Mjolnir. It's possible, all right? It's possible it might be one of them. All these ones that I'm thinking of is possibilities. There isn't, like, you know, it's direct, like, this is tied to the prophecy or anything. It's just possibilities. I mean, there's also potential ones that, well, Zyle and I have dug up before. <laughs> yeah, I know that we're probably not the biggest fan of it. You know, we're not big fans of digging up books. You all but, heard you of know. the Book of the Dead before? Oh, oh don't, don't oh. remind me. Mm -hmm. stories. Very <laughs> I, thought so many times. I thought books were good. Be careful with some of those books. Not, every book. not this, not, one. Not not this, this one. one. Nope, there's, we've had quite our troubles with these books. That being said, it's a possibility. Another one, actually funny enough, it ties to my family. The Ankh of Anubis is a possibility as one of them as, too, as well. But Currently that one's Currently held me. by Set, the yes. primordial deity of chaos itself. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, wonderful. lovely. You should I still would... Yeah, he knows. So I'm far, surprised. what we know is the two that we're leaning towards are things with the ability to pretty much end the world. Mm -hmm. oh. End the world. Two of less them. Deadly. So yeah, that brings up. I also have some news about actually, cause uh -huh. we actually got a us from most of us from the Nordic side. We actually got a hold of an artifact that we think could be a potential one. And okay. again, it's just speculations. Okay. And this Go is ahead. the book of Idrasil. Oh, There's one. To me. Yeah. That, that oh, one. I'm quite oh. aware of that freaking book. So, I is see. it. Have we done any research on it? Could it possibly. Okay, can you, yeah, you don't need you, to do yeah, that. Yeah, can you. Can yeah. you stop. Could you. Very Gee, fancy oh Loki stuff. <laughs> <laughs> what? It's an illusion, everyone. <laughs> don't worry about it's it. Fine. Oh, it's fine. Okay. I just don't. Huh. Anyway, back to it. Yes, book of Idrasil. Blah, blah, blah. What we know about it is that it allows anyone who possesses it to travel between the nine realms all will and nearly as they want to. How many people can it transfer? So well, far, it's tra transported, what was it? Seven, eight of us? Seven, eight, seven and eight. one. Yes. And you eight. said this was owned by the Frost Giants. Yep, so that brings to the bad part of the news. What did you do? Well, we more, the they're, more they're more or less just there more or less might be a hostility between Midgard and Jotunheim at the moment. Jesus, all right, not good, not good. Well, well you stole stuff. said artifact. Well, I'm I sorry, did, I'm not the one who oh, had a glowy eyes to tell us that we needed to collect them. He does bring mm -hmm. up a valid point there. Plus, but, as much as I was against that, if it is uh, one of the nine curiosities, we kind of would have needed it. So... Uh, Hmm. On top of the two that we've mentioned already, a third possibility is a book that can transport armies from one world to another. Precisely. Yes. Okay. Yep. Three. It's kind of good that we have it. Yeah, but why are we looking for these things? Aren't... Maybe this is all bad. Maybe it's just going to cause more problems. Since See? we did started yeah. looking for these, only bad things mm -hmm. have been happening. Yeah. What do you bad. mean only bad things has been happening? Uh-huh. I mean... What are you not saying? something you're not telling us? No. Well, yeah. There's other f evil forces, not just frost giants to worry about. Like what? Like what, exactly? Well, for one, an old friend of ours, uh, Dranus, is starting mm -hmm. to cause issues again. Uh, of course. 
So what mm -hmm. did Dranus do? Dranus? Who's, who's Dranus? Mm. Um, He's, Doom. Uh, the no, we talked about the uh, we talked about death fair. so far, and we talked about chaos. Yeah, yeah this one's doom. Uh, yeah. Yep. Yeah. He not... and whatever you do, do not try to engage him or fight him. Whatever. See him, you run. Well, if I've already met this person, oh, make friends with them. Gotten warnings from them, so now I know that they're mm -hmm. an enemy. I'll keep that in mind. Uh... It's not Drums the only thing we've gotten from enemy. him. What? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Tends to yeah, hand out cubes, and just to check, no one has any little purple cube of kind of evil yeah. aura. Of course, why? <laughs> yeah, well, just, why if you got them, hand them over. You can give them to me right now. I know what to do with them. Nope. How Wait, long has he been purple, standing there? Wait, purple cube. Wasn't that the result of in in what happened last time? Cubes. Shut your mouth. I know what I'm doing with them now. I'm powerful enough to. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna be sick. Well, okay, anyway. I don't think we need These cubes cause yeah, corruption, fine. so if we can limit fine. those as much as possible, it'd be great. Fine, fine, I trust you, Mumichi. Mm -hmm. Just... Yeah. Okay. So would you like to take a seat more, so you're going to stand there all day? I'm just listening in at this rate, really. Dranis, okay. though. You think he's an enemy? Can be. He is. Can be. From what I've heard. From he's helped I've... enemies before. Yeah, I mean, Terrace offered a hug, so yeah. we could hug him. It's not like the God of Death has taken interest in a God of Doom. Um, why just, why just, wouldn't he? He's my just, uncle. Uh, uh, I mean, there are many Gods of Death yeah, it's on the table. That's... That's... I suppose you're right. Great. Uh, Bill? Yeah. Good to hear. They're yeah. related. That's... Uh, so... That's great. That's great. Great. Frost mm -hmm. Giant, one side. Now, Drenus, is there anything else that could go wrong? Yeah, yeah. Well, it's pretty fitting that Morris just showed up. I wouldn't be surprised, huh? Should, yeah. Want me to say it, or should someone else say it? Yeah, you, you should. You just tell them. Tell Another them. old friend of ours came back. Who? The Rose. The seductive Rose, yeah. What? Wait, Brian? He's back. I thought yep. Brian had <sighs> that guy. Nope, yeah. apparently, unfortunately. Apparently he died for nothing. So. <laughs> Wait, but that aren't they connected if Seductive Rose is back? Doesn't there mean there's a possibility that we can bring Brian back? Don't, hey, 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 don't say I, that. Way, don't say that. Don't, yeah, don't give ideas. That's not that's the that... focus right now. Yeah, the focus is not the focus. With death. Uh, it's mm -hmm. a very bad idea. Yeah. Can. Sure, but we can't. I, out of all the research I've done, there's nothing saying that just because the Rose is back, that means I could bring my husband back. Is there anything yeah, saying that's not possible, here, well, that's what I'm trying my best to do, to research well, that. Nothing's great. impossible. Nothing's impossible in this maybe realm, honestly. Maybe we can ask the Rose how he came back, so we can maybe, I guess, bring someone else back. There's no way of negotiating with the Rose. There's no way of Is he right? The dead nope. should stay dead. I, I agree. agree. I, yep, I, I concur. Know. I agree I with disagree. that. The next, I know I mean, if the next time I see that freak, if I see that freaking Rose, I'm gonna... Personally, no, no, him. you won't. Uh -huh. no. Yeah, uh, about that. I've already okay. done that. Um, um, all right, okay, okay. Um, what? Can I bring up one thing about the Rose here? We can't here? fight the Rose. Okay, you did it anyways for me. Yeah, we can't defeat the Rose right now. There's too much stuff that's happening right now. Yeah, I, when, I the... wish there was an easier solution. Oh, I wish there was too. Can we leave the hostilities at the door, boys, please? Anyways, we I can't fight the Rose. Just One don't... second, I'll go up here. We can't defeat the Rose right now, because when Zylo had a one-on-one -on -one fight with him, the Rose said that they were connected to someone at camp. And if we defeated the Rose, well, we would be taking an innocent life as well. Oh, we're not here to do that. We're not here to do that. You would think an innocent life would be worth it for the thousands that could die, but apparently not. Thousands? Millions, uh... from what I hear. It doesn't mean it's right for the person. Just, you, you think it's... We're not going to have this discussion. Um, Bless you. Bless you. But Excuse before me. we make any rash decisions, I've told this to Morse already, I'm gonna, we're going to be doing some research and getting down to the bottom of it before we just go head in and just try to defeat the Rose. Right. Is that understood here, everybody? Yeah, understood. Mm -hmm. Is that understood? We'll, we'll keep it cool. Quick question, though. If we do encounter the Rose, is incapacitating him out of the qu question? I don't think so. No. You can't kill him. Isn't That's decapitating the, the same you as cannot, 
No, like, very much not the same. Incapacitating. No, basically knocking, basically knocking him out. You can knock him out. Oh. Maybe we can trap him or something. But <laughs> I mean, all I say is just be careful. Yeah, I mean, Rose hey, is dangerous, anything... and he's going to try to manipulate you regardless of any kind of contact you have. I recommend finding someone immediately if you see the Rose. Try to get as many people as possible and either run or think of a plan to trap it. Maybe Whatever you do, do not kill it. <laughs> Until I say, we've had this discussion already. I know. I Good. just would really love to hear who this someone is in the camp. Don't worry about it. It's not important. It could be anyone. You okay? Hmm. Anyway, so <laughs> don't trust the Rose. Don't trust Dranus. I'd say not to trust the Frost Giants, but fortunately, they don't have a way of getting here now. Hey, hopefully. Uh, uh, technically, maybe. Uh, it's yeah, what is this giants. whole situation you did with the Frost Giants? Okay, uh, so... Uh, I need an explanation on this. One me, uh, the, so, want me to go over it, or do you want to? Uh, it's fine. To they, kind they, of, they, yeah. they did own the Book of Yggdrasil, uh, but, mm -hmm. you know, they, they're more of a primitive kind of tribe. They're on Jotunheim. Uh, technically, if they got some messenger to Asgard, they could potentially convince Heimdall to open the Bifrost. They potentially could run a threat, but that's a lot of ifs and maybes. I wouldn't consider them a threat. And well, also, how hard is it to get a hold of Heimdall? To get a hold <laughs> You want to... Uh, I don't know. Have better luck winning the lottery. <laughs> Uh, Heimdall is rather particular on who he answers when someone called upon. Although if so... you're good friends with... Uh, no, I'll, I'll uh, keep quiet on that one. Yeah. Well, look, regardless, well... they'd be hunting you down because you guys stole it. Well, uh, did, Didn't we already go in that we're all in this room together? Yeah, yeah and there's... Yeah. Some, yep, and I should also mention, Sado, you know as well as I do, there's another way for... It's not... They can't transport that large group, but you know there's another way yeah. to travel between the realms. I mean, at the end of the day, I've used if they before. do come to camp, I can easily get everyone out. Good to know. Sure. Noted. <sighs> well, that's just one curiosity. What are we going to do about the rest? I don't even know if that is the curiosity. It, well, right. we'll figure it out over time. Carlos, do we want to figure it out, or do we want to leave them alone? Because I'm we... leaning towards leaving them alone. Well, I'm Actually, thinking about cracking up... them. The evils are here. What if they want them? I think they exactly. already do want them. We need to get uh, them before them. Also, another yeah. question. That's how do we point. figure out yeah. how do we figure out if we what is a curiosity and is not? What is it? I've already told oh. you I've done some research on it and there's no guarantee that everything I suggested is even a curiosity or an artifact. It's just a hunch, basically. You think it's powerful? Uh -huh. You think basically you think it's if uh, yeah. if evil gets their hands on it, and you think that uh, they can do some absolute harm with it, and we take it it's away from probably them. a good assumption. You should be the first one to go get it first. <laughs> uh, can I oh. ask something? Sure. Yes. Uh, does it? A uh, curiosity. Uh, it's supposed to be a a big object, right? Something that can change the land or do something big. So far as we can tell. Know. Yeah. Would a would a gl giant glowing object that can change a desolate island into a paradise count as one of those? Quite possibly. I would certainly be I one. I might know where one is. Uh, I go but... get it. it was, All right. It, it's uh, in the middle of the ocean with Mr. Cyclops. Good to know. Get it. It's well, the middle of the no, ocean. No, I feel no. like the only certain people should be going after it. Some people specialize when it comes to ocean. Yeah. I'll put that on the list. That's one thing to go after. The other thing is to go after are either, you know, held by set or uh, able to erase all life on Earth. Which one do we want to go for first? <sighs> well, it doesn't matter. <sighs> Sounds like we either have to choose from bad or worse. Well, Zylo, if uh, we're going after the Ankh... I have to talk to Bercaro first. Obviously. Don't you worry, he's already looking for you. He is? So now what? you chime in. So but... now you tell us something you are not supposed to tell. Wait. 
something? Ah, that's not something I'm not supposed to tell you. He's coming for you, you're coming for him. You will find each other. Uh, well, fair enough, but... So who invited the, the Oracle? I, I invited I'm myself. Hmm. Charmed. And after all that I've heard, there is only one thing I will stress. Do not bring all the artifacts together. Why is that? What? Otherwise you will cause the destruction that you seek to stop. Well, well, it's better than letting the evils get the hands on it, though. Are you supposed to is tell it? us that? Uh, is uh, it really? Do you know that? No, you do not. No. You don't know what this prophecy does, and you don't know what these artifacts do. Now I'm confused. One evil us... with one artifact is not the same as all of them together. So I'm confused. Now you're telling us not to bring them together, but moments ago you said you could, wouldn't tell us anything. I think it was I'm telling you to... not to bring them together. <laughs> That's all I'm oh. telling. Well, you know destiny, you know uh... fate. Is it gonna happen, or is it not? You think I'm going to tell you that? You can't tell us that. He just said that. I was hoping he would at least say that. He didn't say what would happen. Basically, what I'm hearing is this is mine. So if you have any issues, come speak to me. Bye. The Loki you know, son's got a good I trust, I trust the words of an oracle more than anyone else here. I am not an oracle. Well, I feel still feel your power. I'm the Morrigan. I still feel it. It's kind of like an oracle. It seems like kind we just of. ended up with more questions than answers. Oh, That's usually how these meanings go. We need to cut these items before other people do. It's basically becoming a race now. Race against either total doom or total salvation, basically, is what you're saying? Mm -hmm. I've got the potential Egyptian ones. Gonna need a team for it, but I could possibly do it. Xylo, gonna need you for it, but yeah. Yep. Oh, you can always count on me. We're family, right? What? What about the? I will like. I I we'll definitely get a team have some work for well. you. No worries. Yeah. That, I was and going to say I yeah. could possibly go for that one. <laughs> yeah, I'm I'm not alone. You, you are not suggesting of going after Mjolnir. <laughs> are you? Are you Impu? I don't think I have the uh, strength to go after that one. I would recommend having some more of your of uh, the stronger people go for that. Uh, Oh, this also, is it's probably cold, and you know how I feel about the cold, so... Uh, <laughs> remember yeah. last I do remember last time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I prefer not going over there. Uh, <sighs> make sure you grab teams for each of potential artifacts. If you have any others, if you think something is a potential curiosity, it probably is good to go get it before evil does. That's all I'm going to say to that. I'll make sure Hades' treasure is locked down now. hard. Good. Uh, Good. If we don't want to bring them all together, I'm not putting anything else in that treasury. I'll look as it is. I'm not gonna. Br I'm not gonna go after it, but I can try and have a message sent so four can be more on God. That's the right attitude. You will all surely fail if you choose to steal and fight for everything. Yeah. Well, he's about to say no more stealing, but he's already gone. So. Yeah. I just feel like that the safest place for Mjolnir is in four's hands. Makes sense. It's probably best. Probably best. Anyways, <sighs> anything else that needs to be brought up, or are we done? Well, I just wanted to talk to you on a... Well, personally, Mitchell. Just bad timing this whole meeting. That's fine. We can talk downstairs. Hmm. I think I have somebody you might want to meet. Oh. Interesting. Regardless, with that, meeting adjourned. Finally figured it out. I think I've got to the bottom of this now. I just have to make sure. <laughs> hello? Finally, I can oh, enjoy hello? my Hello? Hello? Uh, I... Zylo? Yeah. Uh... Zylo, are you home? Are you home? Yeah, I'm home. Oh my gosh, I'm so glad. Okay, so listen, I've been Come doing all this in. research and I think I got to the bottom of the Seductive Rose thing and I think I know what Seductive Rose is going for. I've been reading all of Brian's diaries, I've been doing research on things, I've been looking up, you know. That's great, yeah. And listen, I got to the bottom of it. The bottom of, oh, I'm sorry, what again? You were speaking a little fast. Oh, well, <clears throat> okay. So you know whenever we had the Atlantis meeting, right? 
people were talking about how seductive rose was tied to someone at camp but nobody knows who it is and so maybe like if, if you get rid of seductive rose and you get rid of an innocent person and so i was doing like a lot of thinking and i decided well let me look at brian's diaries to see if i can figure out a little bit more about seductive rose the seductive rose person and then i started doing some you know i, I was looking into some books that maybe, maybe i shouldn't have been looking into but so you were checking was, into brian's diaries to look into the, what the seductive rose might be looking for and you think that it's looking for something that i said off the atlantis meeting and you are still looking through those books what did you find okay i'm so glad we're on the same page so yeah i was thinking and i realized that the answer is a lot more obvious Seductive Rose might be linked to me. Wait, what? Well, you know, because Seductive Rose was, like, obsessed with, you know, hurting Brian and just everything with Brian. And now that Brian's gone, Seductive Rose has to find a new person to target. And obviously, I'm new to camp. Seductive Rose is all of a sudden back. You think those two are just coincidences? I think not. So I think maybe Seductive Rose might be tied to me. So if you guys do something to Seductive Rose, then I might die. And then, and then, no, and no, then no, 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 I don't think that's the case. I don't think that's the case. You see, Seductive Rose was after Brian because Brian was a specific target for him, one that he could influence and then influence a lot of other people through. So that's why he was doing that. I don't know if that's to do with you. And yeah, but Ryan have, and I are, are you okay? Like, what? You seem a little uh, jumpy right now. Well, I'm not jumpy at all. But listen, you, Seductive you, Rose was trying to get onto Brian because Brian has powers that could cause influence over people. And I was thinking, since I'm a child of Aphrodite, maybe maybe I have the same powers, and maybe Seductive Rose is going to try, you know, come to me and then and then influence me to do the same thing, and, and and then I could hurt Camp because I don't know how to control any of my powers, and I don't even know if I have did, powers uh, yet. But uh, if uh, I did, chill, then chill, chill. I don't know if that's the case. Okay. Why would that but, not be the case? Don't you think it's weird that Seductive Rose comes back when I show up? This has happened before, and you didn't show up before. And plus, I'm going to be honest with you, I kind of know specifically who the Seductive Rose is involved with here, and it's not you. Wait, what? Yeah. It, At the Atlantis meeting, everyone made it sound like they didn't have an idea of who Seductive Rose was. Because I want to protect who's in camp. It wasn't just me and, you know, you at that meeting. It wasn't just Impu. It was other people at the meeting. People who might do something aggressive to the person who it is. You know, oh. if the Seductive Rose is linked to the person who is involved with it. If people, for example, you might want to stay a little quiet about this. Because if people thought it was you, then the person who was trying to go after the Seductive Rose might try to use you to get to the Seductive Rose. They might try to hurt you for some reason to take down the Seductive Rose. Well, then if... If you know who it is, who is it? I, do I know shouldn't them? tell you. Probably. Probably, so I do. I didn't say that. Well, listen, uh, I'm, you know, I'm, I'm not going to do anything. Uh, I, I'm not going to do anything anyone. to the person that they're linked to. I know to. you're not going to do anything to, but we got to be really careful that someone who might do something to them doesn't know who they are. Well, For example, you, you know, we saw... me, then I could help protect them. I don't know if you helping protect them is going to help them be protected. No, no, it's, it's not like that. It, it's just, I think the secrecy is the greatest protection they can have, and a, secret's, a secret gets weaker every time you share it. Okay, so, can I have one guess, and if I guess the person correctly, you'll tell me? No, you can guess, and if you guess it correctly, I won't tell you. But specifically, like this, that that, that would be very unfair. What if you get it right? Well, there's just one person that I really hope it's not. Okay. Well, look, I'm pretty concerned if, you know, whether the King of Atlantis or Moors, the uh, demigod of death, might go after this person. So be very careful with this information. Who do you think it is? Well, I'm just hoping it's not Cal. <laughs> Cal? I don't know. It's just that's the last person I would want it to be. Why are you hoping it's not Cal? I mean, uh, sure, we don't want it to be him to be hurt or anything, but well, why Cal? Because Cal's like my best friend here. Cal and Ivy, at least. And then I really okay. hope it's not Impu either, because, well, Impu's already been through a lot with everything that happened with Brian, and then, you know, there's the kids and everything, and that would just be the most horrible thing in the world. Yeah. Either way, Impu's going to be part of dealing with the problem, so. Yeah. I figured that. Wouldn't it is what it is. But... Away for long. Yeah, I mean he's taking more control over the situation now that other people are taking the lead on searching for the curiosities and all that. Wait, but if you don't tell me who it is, would you even tell me if it was me? Um, I think so. Would you? I'd want you to know to be careful. I'd tell you if it was you, 
Well, does the person know that they're in danger? I probably shouldn't answer that. So no, then. Because I don't want you. I somebody? don't want you going to other people in the camp and try to get the information from them. What, uh, what makes you think I would do that? You can be a little bit nosy, it seems. Well, I'm not nosy. I'm just, you know, I don't want anyone to get hurt. So I'm trying to help That's the best I can. You know, I'm not a warrior and strong like you. I don't know how to wield a weapon have... like other people. I haven't even figured out if I have yeah, any powers have you... yet. So. I think the best thing you can do to help people is figure out how to help people. Ugh, this is the worst thing ever. Look, you've been here for a while and you haven't really tried out any powers yet or, you know, we've seen that you're definitely capable, but I want to see you take control of that. Well, I mean, it's kind of hard when you have such big expectations to live up to. Well, don't take it that seriously. It's not the most massive expectations. You know, I have a friend who's a son of Zeus and he, well, it, it took him, he was a, he was a late bloomer. We'll say it. And I had a friend who's a son of Poseidon, and he was a very, very late bloomer, and might still be blooming at this point. And then there's me, son of Hades, one of the other big three. Everyone thought I was going to be some sort of evil guy, and that didn't happen at all. So, you know, don't let the expectations define you. Just figure yourself out. And I mean yourself out, not just daughter of Aphrodite out. Figure out Brinley. And, uh, maybe, I mean, I don't, it's just a suggestion. I know you're really into doing all this research, going through all the manuscripts and all the writings that Brian's wrote and behind to get that information, but I think it might just be worth doing a little bit of sleep sometime. What? Sleep? I, I, I slept like 72 hours ago. S 72 hours? Well, yeah, there was a lot of reading to do, and I've always made it through all of the diaries, so. How, how much did you sleep 72 hours ago? Um, I took like a nap after the meeting. Uh... A nap? Well, listen, it's fine. I had like 20 cups of coffee. 20? Yeah. That's more than I drink. You drink coffee? Yeah. I I'm getting off track. Okay. Oh, so it's not me. No, so. Not Cal. Nope, what do you, you say? Can... So I say. I mean, even if it was Cal, I guess I might not tell you, but. You don't need to worry, Cal, about all that. He's... Okay, it's not Cal, okay? It's just not Cal. Does that make you feel better? Does it make I mean, you feel at peace? At ease? A little bit, but there's still, like, a crazy person on the loose trying to hurt people. Yeah. There's crazy people on the loose trying to hurt that crazy person on the loose. I just wish that everyone could get along and we didn't have to have these peace treaties and we didn't have to worry about people going after the person that's linked to Seductive Rose so that, you know there weren't so many secrets in this camp that would be nice but our lives are a little more complicated than that i mean to be honest we're a lot more tame than you know all our parents are the gods themselves way worse i mean that's another thing my mother hasn't spoken to me in like forever since the first time i came here yeah it took me a good long time to ever speak to my father even though he was my father it'll happen one day when the time is right. I guess Now, so. uh... You know what? I got a great plan for you. What? 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 Can I help? What, you. what can I do? Yes. You can do something great to help. So, there's some research that needs to be done in your bed. So, go to bed. Uh, oh. uh, 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 go to your cabin. Uh, go to sleep. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Are go to you sleep. sure go that sleep. there's not something more that I can do to, yep. to, to help? Oh, nope. Oh. You're, you're gonna go to bed. You're gonna go to bed. Don't make me push you all the way there. Okay, 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 I'll okay, do okay, okay. I'll go to bed. Yep, and then in the morning, we can talk again. You can get some research in, whatever makes you feel better. After you get some breakfast. Okay, I guess that's not too much to ask. But, you know, don't be like Impu. Impu says that, you know, there's work for me, and then there is none. <laughs> Trust me. Won't be like Impu when it comes to that. Okay, fine. I'll go try to get some sleep. Fantastic. Okay. Hey, Zylo. Yep. Good luck. Thank you. She's not going to sleep, is she?
friends are small. Watch the clock ticking off the wall. But tonight I'm.